Hi, I'm Laughing Woman, and I'm doing a reading this week so that we can all understand how best to move with the energies that the week naturally holds. Our first card is the Achiever of Water, Idealism. Second card is Four of Water, Serenity. Our third card is Eight of Bridges, Adjust. Our fourth card is Major 21, Wholeness. And our fifth card is Major 5, Conformity. So I'm seeing that this week has a lot of emotion in it, a lot of spirit in it, and some wonderful groundedness and connectedness. So know that more than thinking or doing this week, this is about feeling, it's about connecting with spirit, and it's about connecting with that knowledge that we are all one. Begin your week by being with your ideals. Try to live them this week. This isn't just about thinking them. This is about being so present to what your ideal vision for humanity or your own life is that you actually put it into action in some way this week. Move into your serenity from your idealism. Our ideals are our driving visions in life. Those are the things that indicate the reasons why we came into this lifetime. And when we're aligned with those ideals, we're naturally serene. Our minds are peaceful. We're calm. We know all is well. Let yourself enjoy that. From that serenity, you can see how to adjust your life to fit those ideals a little bit better. And so make those adjustments. These are minor adjustments. This is not a major redo of your life. It's just like the picture on the card shows. Just tilt the frame a little bit and you'll be in alignment. From that slight adjustment, you move into wholeness. And what wholeness is, is that place where everyone and everything comes together in a way that works, is supportive, is harmonious and beneficial to all. Let yourself go for that this week. You're capable of creating that wholeness someplace in your life. Do it. And from the wholeness, we move into conformity. And what this is this week, this conformity is about you letting yourself rest in the wholeness that your idealism can actually create. Conform to your own system of harmony and balance this week. So in summary, do something to live your ideals and enjoy the serenity that comes with being in perfect alignment with your soul and your life intentions. Adjust your life just a little bit so that that ideal can become part of your reality and you can experience your wholeness more often. And let yourself rest in that wholeness. Conform to your own ideals instead of allowing other people's shoulds and woulds and coulds diminish who you really are. Have a wonderful, powerful week this week.